I have just installed Nomon Desktop and deployed the Linux image. But when I run Linux, I get this warning message about phantom process killing. So what is this all about? Every application in Android runs in a process. If this process spawns another process, the new process is called a phantom process. Since Android 12, the system enforces a limit on the total number of phantom processes that can run at the same time throughout the system. The default limit is 32 processes. We are running an almost complete Linux system within our application. That means a lot of phantom processes. Even though they are idle, they are still counted against the limit. And this means that eventually, our application is going to be force closed. Luckily, we can stop this behavior, but we need to use ADB, the Android Debugging Bridge. We need to connect the device to a computer and issue some commands. Since we have Linux running on our device, we don't actually need a computer. We will use our Linux to issue the required commands. First, let's go to the settings. The entries in the settings menu differ from one phone to another, so try looking for the closest option. Choose Software Information, then repeatedly press the Build Number option. We have now enabled the Hidden Developer Options menu. Let's go back to the settings and find it. Welcome to the Developer Options. We need to enable USB Debugging. And while we are here, let's enable another option that we will be using later. Look for Force Activities to be resizable. Great! Let's scroll back to the ADB options and enable wireless debugging. You have to be connected to a Wi-Fi network for this to work. Now click the option itself to get the wireless debugging options. What we need is pair device with pairing code. For this method to work, the pairing screen must stay visible throughout the process. But we need to launch GNOME on desktop to perform the connection. So we will be using a little trick. We will open GNOME on desktop in split screen mode. The mechanism used to enter split screen mode differs from one phone to another, so find out how to do it in your own device. Let's open Nomon Desktop, run Linux, enter full screen, open terminal, Open on screen keyboard, enter touch mode, and write ADB, bear, local host, colon, and the port number that appears on the pairing screen. Now let's enter the pairing code and voila, we are now connected. We will run a small script that fixes the phantom process killing for us. Fix phantom. And that's it. You may need to reboot your device for these settings to work. Enjoy.